Hey girl, hey, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am your favorite girl, A. Marie, and I just wanted to pop in and do a quick intro for the ponytail tutorial you guys are about to see. I do have my hair in a bun now, but I wanted to try the new ponytail. Well, it's not new no more. It's new to me now because it's my first time trying it. I'm going to be doing the wrap up ponytail using, is it organic? hair in the length I think it's 24. Now this is my first time trying to do a sleek ponytail. Y'all give me some grace. Let me know how I did. It is my first time and it was like 11 o'clock at night. Here is the video of me trying it myself. It was an unplanned video. I just decided like hey let me just record it. Maybe somebody else need help you know, trying to do it or need the confidence. I'm gonna let y'all get into the video, but before we go any further, I would love for you guys to hit the subscribe button as well as the notification. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and comment something down below once you're done. Now let's go. Hey girl, hey. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am your favorite girl, A. Marie. All right, you guys, so Shapelix sent me over the Air Slam butt lifting high rise waist shorts and i chose the color brown okay so we're gonna see if we can snatch up this body real quick okay so if you guys remember i have done try ons for shape legs i have been working with them for about two to three years now and y'all know i basically swear by this stuff and you guys i've been eyeballing these for a while now oh my god they're such a beautiful brown like so freaking cute i love the color oh i love the fact that it has shape legs on it it has the hooks and the size zipper for easy comfort wear like this is going to be super easy so we have the butt lifting area right here and it does come with a zipper in the middle to go to the restroom and i love that it's lined with cotton i picked the size medium so i do have butt but i do have belly especially now that i just ate so here is my natural shape so i just wanted you to see my little muffin top i got cute little muffin top love handles you know going on here is the butt lifting area and it gives you more of an accurate butt lift the spacing has gotten wider that they have put out before and this is a size medium now i will say go ahead and get your accurate size that you normally wear because it is going to come ready to snatch it comes with the seamless zipper and hook so that it'll mesh well with your clothing this bonnet right here is to help with the comfortability as well as it will not fold over with the boning. It helps with the lining. So on the bottom of the shorts, you guys, it is seamless so that you can't see the edges or your ends in your clothing. So therefore, in our previous shapewear, it used to have grips so that it won't roll. It is cling to your leg but sometimes in your clothing you can see it well this one here is seamless here you are and when i say snatch it snatches all up in here and it actually comes outward and i forgot to tell you in the zipper part where you use the restroom you guys we get 15 more inches to use the restroom <laughs> when i say that is going to make your bathroom experience such an amazing one you won't have to worry at all from the rooter to the tutor is going to be exposed so you won't have no problem trying to take this bad boy off and on when you're out on a go
Guys, I am so in love with this high waisted shorts. Oh, the Air Slim is exactly what it is, Air Slim. I have a 15% off code for you guys for any product on shapeflex.com website. And I want you guys to run over and if you don't get anything else, get you one of these Air Slim butt lifting waist shorts, okay? Now I want it in black. I do have a previous Shapeflex try on home that I will link up in the cards that I did I think a year or two ago you guys should go over and watch that video as well make sure to use the discount code that will be right here on the screen and don't forget to go over to the website and shop shapeflex.com let me know what you guys are picking up I'll talk to you later deuces Okay, girls and guys, let's go ahead and get into this sleep ponytail. As you can see, I'm vibing to my music, took my glasses off. So, disclaimer, you see I took the glasses off? A <laughs> you can't see. Okay, so let's just go ahead and start there. You're going to see at the end why I'm saying that. <laughs> so, because I had my hair in a ponytail already, I kind of just brushed it out and I'm going to use my Conair blow dryer to kind of straighten it out and can we talk about the kitchen because baby I didn't know the kitchen was kitchening back there now I have done a perm on my head and it's been over three years since I had a perm and the regular perm that I put in my head did not get my hair you know caucasian like <laughs> but it's all right so we're gonna take my andy's hot comb i don't know what inch it is but let me go ahead and disclaimer again your girl is scared of the heat so i'm not doing a in-depth hot comb so we're gonna put our hair in a ponytail very loosely so that we could go ahead and start molding i'm going to use this magic wax stick to help lay down my hair around before i start using like the gel and the spray to help get it as flat as possible so we're going to use the comb it's almost self-explanatory i don't want to sit here and like kind of talk every bit of the way but this evens 24 hour edge tamer yeah i don't care what y'all say that even is bomb for my hair and i did go old school and use pump it up extra hold hairspray and we're just gonna try to get the surface and the perimeter as flat as possible but again this is my hair permed after more than three years you guys so i did the best that i can and when i say the best girl y'all gonna see the waves is still waving back there This is what she's looking like thus far. And you see the waves? Okay, okay. As I'm laying down the perimeter, I am taking down the quote unquote baby hairs so that I could redo them. And I'm telling y'all now, baby hairs is a struggle for me. I don't know why it's so hard. But it's like the devil to me. I, I just can't. They don't like me and I don't like them. But they cute. But I just can't get them. So now I'm going to take it down and comb out everything that was pushed to the tip of the twister. And I'm going to put it on as tight as I can. 
and again your girl is semi-blind so my ponytail kind of shifted to the left and I think that's because I'm right-handed it makes it super hard I push everything to the like push all my force over from the right side to the left I'm gonna go in with this lace melt spray from even it's the extra firm hole so this is what people use to lay melt they lace wigs down and I was like if it laid the wigs down so good I know it'll lay the baby hairs so good so that's what I used and when I say it's sticky sticky icky baby is sticky so this is the best I could get with the baby hairs okay so look here that's why I'm showing you I take the back end of my hot comb and I'm just flattening out as much as I can around that hair tie and I'm gonna take these wax racks wrap wrap <laughs> wrap strips and go ahead and tie down so it can help lay down and if y'all hear storing in the background it is my micro bully runts he is he don't miss us he, he don't miss sleep okay that is the best thing he do all day long is sleep so I'm plaiting down my hair and then I'm gonna take some more of the wrap strips and wrap the ponytail down so that none of the glue can affect can't affect my hair y'all haven't did a voiceover in so long Ugh. do y'all miss them let me know I am using I think that's salon hair glue I don't know and I did purchase the hair protecting um I think that's like gel or whatever I did purchase that to use for this particular reason but for some reason I did not use it But it's okay because once I did take my hair down, there was no glue residue on my hair at all. So I'm going around with that even lace melt spray. And I'm going to retie my hair, of course. I don't want to tell y'all exactly step for step like I said. But we are going to get into this organic straight weave. Oh, straight weave. 24 inch in the shade 1b and we're gonna pull in some reinforcements because being in that mirror trying to see what i'm doing and everything is showing backwards girl that's the reason why you're upon a tail crooked now because you're looking at it backwards girl don't be like me do as i say and not as i do and get somebody to help you okay <laughs> get somebody to help you because my ponytail was cricket so i had to call bay in because i was like baby i can't do this backwards i cannot it was getting too hard so i did use one full pack of the organic hair and then like a piece of the second pack as you could tell And for this to be my first sleek ponytail, it came out good, but I got to figure out a way to make my real hair and not poke out in the ponytail, if that makes sense. You guys will see it at the end. So I'm cutting a little piece and I'm putting hair glue on the end so I can wrap it around the base of the hair tie. And while my Bellazia flat iron that I got from Marshalls years ago, while that's heating up, I just run the brush through it, through the ponytail, and put the pump it up at the base. And as you could tell, I went around it with the flat iron. And here I am trying to do the wraparounds little ordeal I don't know what it's called you guys but I try to wrap around the baseline with the hair so that you can't tell it's quote-unquote fake but be I messed up 
it was not coming out right so we had to take that down and retry it and this is the whole purpose of the video is showing you my tips tricks mess ups fix all that good stuff on my first time sleek ponytail okay your girl had to go right back in and try that wrap around again and i did use some of the even edge tamer gel to slick it down and voila so as you can tell genie in the bottle is crooked okay <laughs> The ponytail is crooked, but it's not too crooked to where it's like highly noticeable, but it's crooked. And can you tell what I'm talking about with the ponytail looking out the back? Okay, y'all, this is it. <laughs> this is it. So let me know your thoughts and I'll talk to you later. Okay, bye.